Hi, I'm Simon and I'm joining you from beautiful Yongchan County where I'm exploring a village of the Yao ethnic minority people filled with interesting things that I've never seen before. Yihao. Yihao. Lao Zhenjiang, ni hao ma. Look at these beautiful souls and uh, faces full of character and so warm and friendly. Part of the charm of a village like this is the interesting mixture of architecture. There are some attractive modern buildings, but still with a traditional feel, and some buildings that are hundreds of years old. And one of the beautiful things about a real Chinese village is artwork. Look at this beautiful artwork showing the surrounding mountains. So this is one of the oldest buildings in the village. A house more than 200 years old, which is now a community center. And I'm going to find out what's going on inside. Mm -hmm. So I'm about to spend my 10th mid-autumn festival here in China and a big feature of the mid-autumn time is eating mooncakes. There's a great variety of them and I'm going to introduce a few of those to you guys now. Hello, hello. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. So this will be my first time at trying to make mooncakes, but I think I can do it. So now I'm putting the center into the flattened pastry and wrapping it around. Funny how when I'm doing it on my own this time, it doesn't seem to be quite as easy, but it's coming together. And now we have the basic shape. So we have that there. Now I have to roll it in flour so that it doesn't stick when it goes into the mold, the wooden mold, to get that beautiful traditional design. So now into the wooden mold and flatten it out. How am I doing? Good? How much? Oh, oh, no. Okay. <laughs> <Not in doubt. laughs> okay. So now it's flattened in the mold. Now will it come out? This is the Look at that! Oh, wow, my first solo flight with the mooncake. Okay, now we come to the final stage, which is brushing the top of the mooncakes with whipped egg yolk. So now, finally, into the baker. Okay, now it's finally time to get out the finished moon cakes. My first effort. But look 
how perfect they are. Wow. This has been a real experience for me of traditional Chinese culture and sharing in the creation of the mooncakes, like the Mid-Autumn Festival, has been a symbol and an experience of unity. And when you taste the delicious mooncake, mm. you really get to experience the culture. So a warm welcome for everyone to come to China, to Guilin, to Gongshan, and enjoy the Mid-Autumn Festival. And if you like our video, please like and leave your comments below. Happy Mid-Autumn Festival.